two sewing makes for you. And the first one that I have is another cardigan. So I made Simplicity 8740 again. And this time I made a different view. So I made view C. And this is what it looks like. And view C is this one here. And I like this one. It has pockets, so it's a little different than the other one that I made that didn't have pockets. And the other one I made was view B. And the other one had the drawstring that goes around the front. Well, this one doesn't. So this one just drapes all the way open. And I had stepped out of the box a little bit. I'm super conservative, and I decided to go with a print and a leopard one or animal print at that. So I just wanted to do something a little different, and I'm pleased with the results. Um, these are the pockets that are on the side, and it's really simple, and it's not too much to it. The um, sleeves were supposed to be cuffed, and I didn't want that, so I just left them, you know, I just made the little standard sleeve, and I left it that way. And yeah, it's got a seam down the back, pretty simple, not too much to say about it, so I will go ahead and show you what it looks like on. now which is a stash buster or I always say stash a uh, what is it um, scrap here it goes scrap buster okay so I don't know if you recognize or if you saw my last video this is corduroy that I used in the dress that I wore in my last video so I had a few um, scraps left over so I decided to go ahead and make this top with it and this top is McCall's 7630 this is what it looks like and I made this one here, which is view B. I used three different fabrics in this top. And let me change the camera around so I can show you the whole top. So this is the full top. It's really, really short. And in fact, I didn't even hem it up because it would, you know, it would have made it a lot shorter than it already is. But what I did do is I used the serger around the edge and then I just left that kind of there. And I like that, I actually like the way it turned out. But I have a denim, this is a denim that I used for the sleeves here. And then the back is denim too, but it's a different color uh, denim. So I used that for the back, that kind of denim. And then I just paired it with some high-waisted jeans because if I didn't, my belly was showing. I didn't want that. So if I wear these or, or this top, when I wear it, I will wear it with some high-waisted jeans or maybe, you know, somehow find some type of shirt or something to go under it. Yeah, so that is it. And let me go back over here and sit down so I can get my love share so that I can tell you something that I learned recently. Okay, so I always like to leave you with a love share. And so the love share that I have for you today is regarding GEICO insurance. So GEICO is actually an acronym, which I did not know, and it stands for Government Employees Insurance Company. And in fact, initially GEICO only insured government employees and those in the armed forces. So I thought that that was very interesting. So I wanted to share that with you, and thanks again for watching as always, and I will see you next time.